Here's what I want you to do, okay? The mental movie that I'm playing in my head all day is one of abundance, optimism, and everything is working in my favor. Can you feel that? I cannot be beaten. Nothing is ever going to stop me. It's just a matter of time. Now, how do I do that? How do I have that mental image, mental picture, mental movie going? I decided to sink into an archetype. All right, you need to research this if you don't know about archetypes. Archetypes were popularized by Carl Jung, but the shamanic indigenous cultures for thousands of years have been living in archetypes, okay, for thousands of years, if not more. It doesn't matter. What matters is when you want to make a change, stop trying to be a better version of yourself and literally mentally and emotionally decide to fit into an archetype. Like these are deep, primal, ancient ways of being. So the archetype of the king, how do you, if you're a king, if you're in that archetype, how do you talk? How do you dress? How do you go to work? How do you close a sales call? How do you talk to your clients? How do you go to the gym. If you want a different archetype, pick the magician. Maybe you want to alchemize things. Maybe you want power. The magician wants power, but he does it in a different way. Now, what I'm inviting you into is to research, look into picking a character, all right? Pick an archetype or a character that really makes you, like emotionally gives you sensations of passion and enthusiasm. Pick a character, pick an archetype. Heck, pick something from Marvel if you want to. Pick somebody who you can sink into their embodiment, how it feels to be them. How are they thinking? How are they serving other people? How are they feeling all day about themselves? That's the invitation. All right, pick an archetype, go with that. It's going to save you so many years. Ciao.